James Carpenter with Country Living. Welcome to my channel and thank you for watching my videos. All right, if you've been following the uh, shipping container pole barn build over the last couple years, you'll see that we've come a long way. What we're going to do now is we're going to install this it's a uh, masonry board I uh, the the hardy board it's uh, approximately two inches by about 12 footers I there it is I purchased it from habitat it had been stored outside and got a little bit crusty and musty looking but that brought the price down to a very very cheap price so we cleaned that up, gave it a fresh coat of paint, and uh, when we got finished, it looked real good. I didn't show the install, but this is the final product. Now what it's designed to do is to cover that seam between the 8-foot sheet and that 2-foot section that continues on to the ceiling. And as you can see, it, it made a world of difference in the shop. So basically, the shop is 98% finished as far as construction goes. I'm still working on the uh, electrical. I gotta pull some more wires. You can see that box there with some wires hanging out of it. I um, they're not hot, by the way. But anyhow, I gotta pull some home runs for that back to the panel box and get it all tied into the breakers. That corner used to be 45 together where the paneling was, and it had a really nice clean seam. But we put that uh, molding over it, really dressed it up. And then the molding goes behind the shelves. And then down here at the base of the furnace filter, we dressed that up with some of that hardy plank and uh, made that look a little bit better. So with all that being said, let's take a quick look around in the shop so you can see overall how everything's turned out for me. The, um, the room back here that we're about to enter is the, uh, I call it the furnace room. You'll see a couple of four inch PVC pipes stubbed out of the floor back there. Eventually, I want to tie this into the uh, septic system and um, the water, have the water come in through the other pipe and have a, a bathroom in this uh, building. Now, this is going to be my personal office. Now, it looks pretty cluttered right now, but obviously, as we all know, it's not hard to create clutter. But this is another project and another video in itself to, to clean this room up and get my desk in here and get this all set up. A lot of that stuff you see there on the floor is tools I purchased for the new building. I want to thank everybody for watching my videos. If you enjoy the content, by all means subscribe. If you're already subscribed, thank you.